guys welcome back to my channel how are you all today is sunday a relaxing fun filled day some are busy cooking some are doing household activities and while i was cleaning up something i found out a box of imitation jewelry for those of you who don't know we are three sisters i'm the middle one i stay in mumbai and both my sisters stay in guwahati and this has been a house where three girls were growing up and from our childhood days we have been associated with the cultural field like in school college or outside we have been doing a lot of functions cultural programs and dance so we have had a good collection of imitation jewelry which is used uh, for our performances so uh, when i found out this box i thought i'll begin this video by sharing with you quickly our current collection of imitation jewelry though these are not in use uh, actively now they were in, inside the box this collection keeps changing we keep on discarding and then we keep on adding new ones you i'll try and show you other things uh, in the video ahead let's begin the video by quickly showing the collection this is our current collection of traditional imitation jewelry though for our folk dance which is bihu and our classical dance form which is kshatriya these kind of jewelry are not used because that requires actual authentic asmis jewelry okay let's show you one by one this is some sort of traditional rajasthani jewelry earrings mangtika that's a hand um, ornament that's a big neck piece and then a long neck piece so entire thing has come as a set and that's a pile Uh, moving on oh just to tell you here that i have displayed all this in one of our rooms which also has a corner for music now uh, these are mangtikas single ones double ones one sided ones this is a small one and these are neck pieces some rings here and then moving on these are some nose pieces so these are nuts and nose rings and some of the smaller ones i have got it from mumbai and these are collection of big earrings i'll quickly show you one by one some chumkas some other danglers and this is a earring extension and these are some of the beautiful ones which i have and then that this is a ha hair accessory and this box has a collection of some small and medium size earrings moving on then these are brooch pins then at last some bangles so that's the collection everybody is calling me for lunch now so i'll quickly go and finish my lunch That's my lunch plate. So what do I have? Some okra ki sabzi, then homemade pickle, small fish curry, and then there's chicken, and then there's asmis dal. is another day uh, the previous part of the video that you had seen is of another day actually that was shot a month back but somehow the video i could not complete the video and then a lot of problems uh, we had undergone uh, before i go into too much of depth of uh, what is katibihu and what we are doing let me show you what have i worn so and the surprise thing is me my mother and my younger sister are kind of matching our outfits missing my elder sister let me show you my mom she also had suffered covid along with me but now she is recovering <laughs> so kind of utswaku to so kind of matching outfits and let me also show you my younger sister give me the camera evela evela So, so that's my younger sister Hi. and my mother. So we will show you uh, some work is going on. So let me continue with the explanation. <laughs> 
ki bihu is one of the three bihus that assamese people celebrate and in kati bihu do the other two bihus uh, means merry making having grand feast and all kati bihu uh, basically means that uh, the assamese people pray to god and they also light diyas in their khets which is their farms and also in front of the tulsi ka plant so that they have good harvest in the year so now in the times of corona when we are suffering and there are a lot of people suffering we have done little bit of arrangement we do it every year so thought of sharing all this with you so we are going to light diyas usually you can just light one diya in, in your tulsi plant we don't have farms here we live in the city uh, so let me show you so i am doing some arrangement here we always like lighting a lot of diyas and not just one diya so uh, it's already dark outside these are the diyas and then i am just making this and i'll keep you updated my elder sister is not here currently and we are missing her though we had advised her that she should also wear something of this sort so all three of us kind of have worn similar outfits my brother in law in fact all the male members of our family including my father are always ready to help that's a uh, atulsi plant uh, which is actually common in every household in their front yard it is not visible that much in the capture because it is dark and that's the three of us uh, my mother my younger sister and me we it's a kind of a big tulsi plant only and uh, my elder sister missing in the frame though and we three have grown up seeing our mother creating art in every single thing that she touches and we have always been inspired from her the smallest of the smallest things she'll just create wonders and this is just a a small example of it that usually people just light one diya in their tulsi plant but we have always seen our mother creating patterns in it so that's the final outcome i think it looks beautiful and it's so serene and peaceful and it gives a sense of calmness of the mind সকলোখিনি অসমিয়া বন্ধু বান্ধবক কাতি বিহুর উলক যাচ্ছিল দ্যাটস ইট ফর টুডে ইস ভিডিও থ্যাংক ইউ সো মাচ ফর ওয়াচিং দিস ভিডিও ওয়ান্টেড টু এড ওয়ান থিং ইয়ার দ্যাট উই ওয়ের ওয়ান অফ দোজ ফিউ পিপল হু ওয়ের এক্সট্রিমলি কেয়ারফুল অ্যান্ড উই ওয়ের টেকিং আ লট অফ প্রিকশনস বাট স্টিল উই কুড নট এসকেপ করোনা সো প্লিজ ডু নট টেক দিস থিং ক্যাজুয়ালি স্টে সেফ বিকজ দ্য সেফটি ইজ ইন ইয়োর হ্যান্ডস থ্যাংক ইউ ওয়ান্স আগেন ফর ওয়াচিং দিস ভিডিও আন্টিল দ্য নেক্সট ভিডিও বা